everyone, welcome back to DIY with Ilz Marie and Castle Timbers. I am Ilz Marie and today I'm going to show you how I customized my sofa insert from Castle Timbers. When you order your products from Castle Timbers, you receive them in a raw pine medium. Now, pine is great because it's a hardy wood and the raw pine is a great medium to be able to pretty much do with it what you want. You can paint it, you can do all kinds of really, really cool stuff with it. And I decided that I wanted to bring in a little bit of a pop of color, contrast color in my living area. And so I decided to paint my sofa insert green and i wanted also to create a little bit of a worn surface so that it's not just a fully solid painted sofa insert there are so many amazing how-to videos available online to show you how to paint and create all kinds of different techniques i used a duck egg as a base on my sofa insert to get a little bit of that color through at the end and then I covered it with the kind of like a bottle green that I wanted my sofa insert to be. I also made sure that I used a little bit of wood filler for any uneven surfaces there where I connected the, the screws and made sure that I assembled the sofa insert. I wanted to surface uh, even those surfaces out and so I used some wood filler there and then spent some time sanding the entire sofa insert down to ensure that the surface is nice and smooth and ready for the paint. For those of you who are interested in what the materials are that I used, I used fired earth chalk paint these are really great products from Builders Warehouse. The base color, uh, the little bit of like a duck egg is called Cactus Green. And then the more bottle kind of green that I used at the top is called Malachite Green, also from the Fired Earth Chalk Paint range. And it's the first time that I used the specific darker green and I quite enjoyed it. I found a pot plant stand that I'm also going to be painting in that color because now I am a little bit obsessed with it. Because this will be a hard used surface, I also made sure that I gave it a really good coating and I use the Harlequins Protect Poly Matte Coating. It is, I'm not a personal fan of high shine products, so I always opt for anything that is matte. It's a really great coating. I use it on pretty much anything. I have recently done a bathroom floor where I use that coating on there. So it's hard wearing, it can handle stains, it can handle any of the roughness that any kind of like coffee table in the living area has to endure. So you can find it, all of these products at your local hardware store. For those specific brands, they are more specific to Builders Warehouse. Let us know in the comments if you enjoyed this customization video. Tell us whether you love the colors, do you hate them? And let us know what you would like to see more of. So what is the next project that you think we should tackle? And how would you like us to share with you in terms of what we're doing, how we're DIYing and how we can turn your castle into a home.